Time to celebrate! Star Trek IV has been officially announced by J.J. Abrams, but this won't be just another Star Trek adventure. No, no, this time we're about to see something different. With no further ado, here's everything you need to know about the much-anticipated installment. Just a fair warning, we've included some mind-blowing theories. Let's start off with the fact that Star Trek IV is officially in the works. After many delays and a lot of anticipation, Star Trek IV has been officially announced by J.J. Abrams. Yes, that's right, most dedicated fans of the franchise have no reason to worry because Variety reported that the continuation is in the works. The confirmation comes from the Paramount Investors Day presentation in February 2022. In the given statement, Abrams himself revealed that they are working hard on the upcoming Star Trek film. He also affirmed that filming will begin sometime at the end of the year. The best news is that this time, we'll meet a bunch of new characters. Does this mean everyone else we met in the previous installments is on board for Star Trek 4? Well, we'll get into that a bit later in the video. Now let's see if there's an official release date, shall we? Sadly, we're still waiting for more pieces of information regarding the new film to be announced, but we think we can easily guess the release date. Back in 2009, J.J. Abrams decided to release a reboot of the Star Trek franchise and because of the film's major success and popularity, two more films followed. And surprisingly enough, these two films were even more successful than their predecessor. The first installment, 2013's Star Trek Into Darkness and 2016's Star Trek Beyond, have been so successful that they earn more than a billion dollars at the box office altogether. Great work, Bones. Thanks, Jim. Now I just gotta figure out how to land. The fact that fans and critics flooded the movies with positive reviews was a guarantee that another film will happen in just a matter of time. But this doesn't mean that the franchise had it easy. In fact, it's quite the opposite because there have been a lot of people who decided to exit the project, which led to a lot of delays, which led to the release date being continually pushed back. We also know that you need to smash that like button if you haven't done it already. Okay, seriously, Star Trek IV has been under development for longer than you can imagine. In June 2015, The Hollywood Reporter gave the first update regarding production, revealing that Chris Pine, Kirk, and Zachary Quinto Spock had both shown interest in Star Trek IV. And again, we need to remember that this was way back in 2015, a simpler time. By the way, this was the year Drake's Hotline Bling was released. Damn, we're getting older. Anyway, years went by and no one showed further interest in the project, Thanks to The Hollywood Reporter, we do know that Pine and Chris Hemsworth left Star Trek IV because of payment conflicts in 2018. One year later, Deadline announced that the film had been delayed. Another update followed, and the movie was set to release on June 9, 2023. They again changed the release date to December 22, 2023, but this was changed as well, with the film being removed from the release date slate. This clearly means that we really don't know when the film will release, but if I have to make a wild guess, I think we'll see it sometime in 2024 if the creators work through whatever they're struggling with. I have a feeling that the main issue with this film is creative differences, but again, no one has come out to reveal what's wrong and why there are so many delays. So, who's on board for Star Trek 4? The main issue with this film is that everyone involved in the production is keeping their mouths shut. In other words, even if the film kept the original release date in 2023, we still wouldn't have known the cast involved in the project, which is a bit weird, right? In his June 2022 announcement, Robbins said he knows that most dedicated fans of the franchise want the original cast from the reboot in this movie, and if they decide to recast everyone, fans would be surprised. If the cast stays the same, we expect to see Chris Pine, Kirk, Zachary Quinto, Spock, Zoe Saldana, Uhura, Carl Urban, Bones, John Cho, Sulu, and Simon Pegg, Scotty. Urban showed a particular interest in Star Trek in March 2022. He told Digital Spy that he hasn't read a script yet, but he would love to work with his co-stars again because, according to the actor, they had so much fun. Shortly after the release of the third film, some reports suggested that the plot for the next film will focus on Chris Pine's James T. Kirk joining forces with his dead dad, played by Chris Hemsworth. Hemsworth did an interview with Digital Spy in May 2019. During the interview, Diaz asked why he departed the movie. His answer was that he didn't feel like they landed on a reason to revisit that yet, adding that he didn't want to be underwhelmed by what he was going to bring to the table. 
Um, okay. While we still don't know whether Hemsworth will return to reprising his role in the fourth movie, in October 2022, J.D. Payne and Patrick McKay revealed more pieces of information regarding the plot of the next film, saying that the conceit was that through a cosmic quirk in the Star Trek world, they were the same age. Also, there's a good chance the creators will recast Pavel Chekhov following Anton Yelchin's tragic death in 2016. As one of the fan-favorite original characters, Pavel Chekhov feels like an essential part of the franchise. The character was played by the amazingly talented Anton Yelchin, who sadly lost his life in an awful car accident in June 2016, just a month before the release of Star Trek Beyond. His passing is, without a doubt, something fans of Star Trek will never recover from. His passing also affected the production of the fourth film, and some fans claim a fourth installment should never happen because recasting Pavel Chekhov seems wrong on so many levels. In March 2022, when the film was set to be in development, Uhura actress Zoe Saldana told Entertainment Tonight that they are all heartbroken by the death of their friend and co-star, but they also feel like they should gather together again and make this much-anticipated movie so that the audience could enjoy yet another masterpiece. A lot of things prove that the role of Chekhov won't go through recast. For example, in a 2016 interview with Post Media Network, shortly after Yelchin's death, producer J.J. Abrams said that there was no replacing him. There is no recasting, I can't possibly imagine that, and I think Anton deserves better. What do you guys think about this? Let us know before we get into these surprising plot details. Based on everything we mentioned before, it's really difficult to guess the plot for the next film because the creators keep the plot details under wrap, which is not surprising considering the production of the film. But it's highly probable that the film will continue right after the events of 2016's Star Trek Beyond, which was directed by Justin Lin. In the third installment, Kirk and the rest of the USS Enterprise gang have their ship crash on the planet Ultimate. Who did this? Pre-Federation human soldier Idris Elba's Captain Balthazar Edison. When the crew discovers that Edison has plans to destroy the Federation, they have to go through a difficult mission. Stop Edison without the help of their ship. We previously said that there were some plans to make the next film about a reunion between Captain Kirk and his father, George. But George is dead, right? This would have only happened if the creators involved the time travel storyline, which would have been great, at least according to me. We also know that you need to smash that subscribe button and notification bell, so you'll never miss any of our videos in the future. Chris Hemsworth played George Kirk in 2009's Star Trek, but he appeared in a short cameo and as mentioned, it was confirmed that he won't reprise his role in the next installment. So what could Star Trek 4 focus on? See you in the next video.